ओके क्वेश्चन नंबर नाइन फ्रॉम एक्सरसाइज फोर्टीन इट से दैट इन द गिवन फिगर ए बी बी सी एंड सी डी आर इक्वल कॉर्ड्स ऑफ अ सर्कल विथ सेंटर ओ एंड ए डी इज अ डायमीटर इफ एंगल डी ई एफ इज हंड्रेड एंड टेन डिग्रीज फाइंड एंगल ए ई एफ एंड एफ ए बी so we in uh, order to find angle aef we need to join the line ae then only we get this angle aef okay so how to find this angle this total angle fed is 110 degrees now using our properties that we discussed in the last Uh, session if we consider this arc which is a semicircle then this angle is 180 degrees and if this angle is 180 degrees then this angle will be half of that angle aed is half of angle aod by the property angle subtended at the center is double the angle in remaining part so that will be 90 degrees so if that angle is 90 degree then we can find angle aef because it is the difference of two angles 110 degrees and 90 degrees So our first answer is twenty degrees. Angle AEF. This is twenty degree. Then so this was our ninety degrees, and this is twenty degree. Now given that three arcs are three chords are equal AB, BC, and CD. so if we join b e and c e then we can write these three angles equal because they are angles subtended by equal chords angle a e b equals to angle b e c equals to angle c e d because they all are subtended by equal chords or we can say equal arcs and then total of these three is 90 degree as in our previous step so each angle would be 90 divided by 3 that is 30 degrees so this angles are 30 degrees each now if we just remove this line ae then this total angle feb would be addition of these two 20 plus 30 and that is 50 degrees and if we consider now the quadrilateral a b e f then opposite angles of cyclic quadrilateral are supplementary so we can write angle f a b which is opposite to angle f e b so 180 minus angle f e b so that will be 180 Minus fifty, hundred and thirty degrees. This is our second answer, and this was our first answer. Question number ten says that in the given figure A B C D E is a pentagon inscribed in a circle, so we can say it is a cyclic pentagon. 
all four points are all five points are on the circle then sides ab bc and cd are equal so there's these three chords are again equal says in the previous question and angle bcd is 110 degrees and angle oh it's angle this is angle bae 120 degrees and you have to find four angles abc cde aed and ead so for this if we join be and bd okay if we join be and bd then we can find this angle cdb which is equal to cbd because of formation of isosceles triangle so angle cdb that will be 180 degrees minus 110 degrees divided by 2 by angle sum property of a triangle these two angles are equal x so 2x plus 110 degrees is 180 degrees so each value of x will be half of the difference of 180 and 110 so that you can use sum of all angle is 180 degrees so 2x plus 110 equals to 180 degrees so x is equals to 180 minus 110 divided by 2 that will be 35 degrees so angle b no not b angle c db angle c d b equals to 35 degrees now if we see this quadrilateral b a e d it is a cyclic quadrilateral where we are given with 120 degree as angle a so the opposite angle of 120 degree that is angle b d e that would be 180 minus 120 degree because opposite angles of a cyclic quadrilateral are supplementary so that is 60 degrees so this angle we got as 60 degrees yes so similarly if we take quadrilateral bcde then angle B E D would be 180 minus 110 degrees. That is 70 degrees. So this angle is 70 degree. Arc B C is subtending angle at D, which we have marked as X, and arc A B is subtending angle at E. This part of e that we can mark as y and this chords are equal so their arcs are equal and thus their angles subtended are also equal so we can say angle a e b is equal to angle b or let me write as C D B because they are angles subtended by equal chords and we know C D B is thirty five degree so this A E B is also thirty five degree okay now. if we see the entire cyclic pentagon we are missing with only one angle which is bac angle bac we don't know rest all angles we know at c at d at e and at a 
so what is angle sum property of a cyclic pentagon angle sum of pentagon is equals to 540 then we can find angle a b c that would be 540 minus the sum of all remaining angles if we start from c 110 then angle d which will be 95 then angle e would be 105 and angle a is given 120 so what will be the answer of abc so we got our first answer 110 degrees so we can write here 110 degrees now cde angle 60 plus 35 so that will be 95 degrees then aed that also we have in the figure 105 and then ead now for ead we need to join the line ead so if we join the line ad and we have to find ead ad this angle okay if we see this cyclic quadrilateral abcd then angle bad would be 180 minus 110 that is 70 degrees because opposite angles are supplementary so our angle a which was 120 degree is divided in two parts one is 70 degree and other is angle ead so now we can get angle ead equals to 120 minus 70 degrees that is 50 degrees so this is our fourth answer